Hey, what's up? This is Scott with Level Up Tutorials, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you some amazing color highlighting using a package called Pigment. Now, this takes the color highlighting that you get in some other packages and really just takes it to the next level by even giving you a window of your palette with all of your values. It's really cool. So let's check it out right now. So in this video, I'm going to show you one of my favorite features from Sublime Text. Uh, it's actually a package in Sublime Text, but uh, somebody has also made this package for Atom, which is really great because it's one that at this point I just can't live without. So this package is going to help you define your colors in your style sheets and things like that. So when we have a style sheet color, you're going to have the representation of that color. So let's head to Settings. Let's come to Install. And I have this color highlighting. We're actually going to be using a package called pigments. If you search for pigments, you're going to find this pigments project right here. So let's go ahead and install that. Now what's neat about this pigments is that there's actually a palette component built into this. So after we install this, I'm going to head to my intermediate.stylus file and we're going to check it out. Okay, so we have this installed and you can see upon saving this file, we now have the colors listed here. So red is appropriately highlighted with the correct red color. This teal is correctly highlighted and so on and so forth. So as you can see here, all of our colors, even the transparent ones that we have up here are correctly represented in our document. And more importantly, when we call those variables in stylus or sass or any of that stuff, it's going to continue to highlight that correct color. You'll notice that when I actually put my cursor over it, that highlighting goes away, so it's not obnoxious when you're typing. Now let's come back here and let's check out one of the cooler features of Pigment. Now we can start our command palette simply by doing Command Shift P and we can type in Pigment. Now you'll see there's some options here. We have Reload, Find Colors, Show Palette. Let's go ahead and select Show Palette. You'll notice that some other options in here like convert to RGB, convert to hex and RGBA. Those are really nice useful tools to have as well. But I want to show this palette. When we select that, what you can see is all of the colors that we've defined in our project are being shown as a palette. Now what's even cooler here is that the variable names themselves are actually displayed here along with an RGBA value. So we have dark perp, perp, uh, light gray, gray, black, all that stuff. So as you can see here, social, it even goes as far as looking within objects in Stylus. So social.twitter is going to be Twitter's color, social.facebook. So this palette can give you a really nice way to find all of your colors immediately. We can also sort them by name, sort them by color, merge duplicates, you can group them, uh, all sorts of good stuff here. Now let's go and try one of those utilities. I'm gonna have this uh, hex value and I have this selected here. Now I'm going to type in pigment, and now I'm going to say convert to RGB. Upon doing that, you can see it completely converts us to an RGB value. Now I'm going to undo that, and you can see the same thing in action just by placing the cursor in the middle of it, and I'm just going to say pigment convert to RGBA, and you can see I don't even have to have the text highlighted, I just have to have the cursor in the text itself. And you can see we now have an official RGBA value right here. And you'll notice if we make this something like 0.5 here, save this, hover off, you can see that transparency is definitely represented. So now this is really the best package for color highlighting and color utilities with Atom. It basically takes something that was in a Sublime Text package and really, really supercharges it into a way that makes this just really, really great to use. So this is Pigments for Atom. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to check out the rest of the series before they're released, you can head to store.leveluptutorials.com and purchase these videos for immediate access. As always, this is Scott with Level Up Tutorials. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.